If there is no yearning for heaven, what is the point of living for humans? Xiefeng, the yearning and longing for a better life, is the dividing line between noble and base personalities. The nobility of a person does not come from possessing vast material wealth, social status, or being admired by the secular world. It comes from the inner yearning, longing, and spiritual motivation for a better future. If a person lacks the yearning and longing for a better future and his mind is filled with money, status, power, and fame, then he is not fundamentally different from a fat pig in a pigsty. Animals are animals because they only see immediate interests. Humans are humans because they have the yearning, longing, and pursuit of a better future. Where is the most beautiful life in the future? Of course, it is in heaven. If there is no yearning for heaven, what kind of life can humans live? Exaggerating a bit, they can live like maggots crawling on a pile of rotting flesh. Some people say that heaven does not exist. If this perception is correct, then tomorrow also does not exist. If people believe that things they cannot see do not exist, then tomorrow cannot be seen. So how can it exist? Since the unseen tomorrow exists, then the unseen heaven also exists. Some people can foresee the coming of tomorrow through the history of the earth and the changes in the sun, moon, and stars. People have no doubt about this. So, why doubt the existence of heaven when some people can see it through the categories and survival states of life? and the principle that the sum of positive and negative energy in the universe always equals zero. There are only two types of people in this world. Those who yearn for heaven and those who struggle for food, clothing, shelter, transportation, and the cycle of birth, aging, sickness, and death. Those who yearn for heaven live with clarity, purity, tranquility, openness, naturalness, simplicity, ease, and contentment. Those who are ignorant of heaven or have no yearning for it live with constraint, impatience, anxiety, depression, worry, occasional exaltation, occasional despair, worries about gains and losses, and fear. If there is no yearning for the heavenly life, how can humans live? Just look at the brutal survival scenes in the animal world. Humans can only live like animals. Why doesn't human society resemble the animal world entirely? That is because there are still people who yearn for the heavenly life. Once those who yearn for heaven cease to exist, the living conditions of human society will be worse than those of the animal world. If a group of people can live together in harmony, it is undoubtedly because most of them yearn for a heavenly life. If a group of people cannot live together in harmony, it is undoubtedly because they have no yearning for the heavenly life. What keeps the flame of human civilization alive is not politicians, scientists, artists, entrepreneurs, and so on, but those who are filled with longing and yearning for the heavenly life and who persistently strive and work for it.